All right, for riff number 10, I'm going to take my sliding thirds and complete the most common riff that you usually hear this played with. I actually did it in the other demonstration, but let's look at this. I'm going to start with that third, and then I'm going to come back into my main pentatonic pattern, this pattern here, fifth fret, the pentatonic pattern that everybody learns when they first learn how to play guitar. And I'm going to do something here. I'm going to do two notes at once, something we call a double stop. Anytime you play two notes at once, it's referred to as a double stop because you're stopping the strings and you're stopping two of them, double. Okay? When I do this pattern, I'm going to play, my first finger is going to end up straight across the second and third string at the fifth fret. My third finger is going to end up straight across at the seventh fret right after I do the sliding thirds. So I'm going to come off the sliding thirds to my third finger at the seventh fret. Notice I had to back my hand up. Then my first finger hits the fifth fret. And then my pinky comes in and hits the root note A at the seventh fret on the fourth string. I put a little vibrato on that. So the way the riff should work happen to know the song Sweet Home Chicago, that's pretty much the, the opening riff of the song, pretty close to it. Okay, this is riff number 10, so I'm going to play it a couple more times, slowly and then a little quicker. Mm -hmm. 